I'm going to show you one way that I batch test my mushroom liquid culture jars to see if any of them are contaminated. In this example, I'll be testing 10 jars of lion's mane liquid culture. So here I'm using a sterile syringe and needle to extract half of a milliliter of liquid culture from each jar using a new needle between jars. Once I've extracted some liquid culture from each jar, I shake the syringe and then squeeze a drop out onto a nutrient agar plate. I seal the plate with parafilm and incubate at 75 degrees Fahrenheit. If the results were clean, all of the jars would be good to go, but it looks like there was some yeast contamination, so now we have to use 10 syringes, 10 agar plates, and 10 needles. Now I have to test each individual jar on its own agar plate to weed out which one was contaminated. This will help me figure out how many of the 10 jars I can keep and are good to use, and then how many of them I have to toss out. Once all 10 agar plates have been inoculated, I incubate them at 75 degrees Fahrenheit. After a few days, the agar plates revealed that jar 1, jar 2, and jar 10 were contaminated and the rest are good to go.